and here we are in the second episode guys thank you for joining me in today's video so let's talk about the map real quick so now again I got three anchors here but I wanted to show you a few things so always when you come on the new junction like this if you don't like the layout if you have only one anchor but you just don't like it or if it if the weather is like this raining you can just reload the save guys so now let's see how many tries I'm gonna need to get the three anchors again now you see the map is just turned a bit now it's two anchors starting from here so the roads are always the same it's just turned around or flipped you know what I mean and you can get uh, different spawns so you always want good weather at least and three anchors let's do it again now this is second reload again good weather only two anchors again from this side so let's just reload again now the third reload again a good weather and again three anchors guys so now I will play this map just wanted to show you how you can always reload at the start or if you messed up something you damage your car too much you don't just don't want it you can just reload from the start and then do it again so now I'm gonna pick up this tape and all this then we will continue here and all the way down here but actually I will need to go first here then here then drop down there and then just go and grab as much as I can before we leave this junction guys so now let's listen a bit of this oh, you know what my favorite I'm gonna just talk as we go player. like the last time this slides is shit okay I'm not gonna stop for this this again so let's see, the first house is actually there, but again, if you want to know exactly where it is, guys, just zoom all the way in, mark it like this, and now I can't miss it, you know what I mean. So then again, I will just scan everything as we go. So this is left, right, anomaly. If you go into this with your car, you're just gonna throw your car away, left and right, it's gonna mess with the dashboard, turning lights off and on and everything. But it's easy to actually manage that one, I will show you later when I run into one with the car. Now let's just pick all this, my sensitivity is a bit high, let's just fix that, okay. Now here, did I scan this? I didn't, so it's a hazmat cabinet, guys. I'm just gonna scan everything as we go. And loot everything, of course. That's what you wanna do at the start. Now another tape. Tobias mentioned that the remnants bind themselves to people, like the cars done with you, and how that led to obsession. These obsessions only started innocent. So let's go and grab this also, because it's very close. Now another thing that I wanted to show you guys. If the tool is going to break, then you don't want to use it. But I will use it now just to show you. So now you see this is the last hit from this tool, right? And if I use it here, I'm not gonna get plasma. I will just get the other. Okay, now I got it, but uh, usually you don't get the resource that you are farming when it's the last hit from the tool. So keep, uh, keep that in mind also. Now again, just watch the top left corner and watch for the arrow, guys, and you always know where is your car. So let's go back now. It's good because I found a lot of plasma here also. So what is that? Some random car. I don't want it. But did I scan it? I did, okay. Now let's continue. So need to zoom out now so to see where we are okay so we are going for the tape next then we will continue another tape i wonder if you're already feeling the remnants effects driver have you been fixating on the car maybe if only we knew where remnants came from then we'd have a place to start on how to help you this is no typical anomaly right. so i will not yeah, uh, yeah, stop yeah, the anomalies we know Okay, this is now silver mist, guys. Again, this is electric damage, so you don't want to go with your car through this. Because it's gonna charge your car and then it's gonna damage it over time, you know what I mean? Now let's see where the tape is. You can drive like this, but it's not really great with the summer tires. Now when it's straight like this, it's okay, but... Uh, you don't want to climb any mountains or hills, guys, and this is the 
the thing that we need so this is the zone receiver here you can grab these tapes that will tell you more about the story lore let's hear this one so now the next thing I'm gonna go here and then easily towards the anchors so what we want to do guys, we want to build off-road tires first, a limb shield, things like that. Then the turbo light engine of course, then the iron shield, and that's actually all what you need for this game guys. So now, I don't need these shitty lights actually. Where is that small house? Okay, so it's over here. Let's check that out. Now this is just a... It's just stones called potholes. We can deal, uh, they can deal damage to your car if you run through them, but later when you have the limb shield... It's all good, guys, so... Nothing much here. Oh, but look at this. All right, and one more. I almost missed everything. So nothing more here. I can't scan the house. Let's leave all this here. And this. So far so good, car is not damaged guys. And uh, now let's continue here and then to the right. First, no no, not to the right actually, but I'm gonna go straight first. Grab the first anchor, then go back. Grab the other one and then go down. Right. That's the plan. And of course along the way, we want to grab the plasma. Oh no, but I don't have... Let's see, can I build... Okay. But, uh, yeah, now I don't have any more scrap metal or the gears. And we need scrap metal for all of that, so... There is no any car here to just scrap it now. But okay, we will leave this... Plasma then, and just continue. Okay, don't hit the car, please. Fuck off. I see a little bit of electrical damage, guys, but... It's okay not that much so I want to find the peacemaker also but first if I go here and then go back there and down yeah okay let's go first grab this one I want to find one peacemaker guys here to show you how that works so if you find peacemaker anywhere it can be spawned on any map then the, that guy works you can charge your battery I mean you can charge your car battery there or you can add things inside and then change for something else. Like uh, plasma for three candy guys. Now let's just scan this guy, glittering boulder. This will give you a boost of speed. But I rarely use that because you can it can end up badly and I just don't like to use that. You know what I mean? So now I'm just gonna grab the tires. And actually here I can grab then a little bit of scrap metal also just to just so that I can build uh, this what I wanted and again this tire is still gonna give you rubber even though it's, it's like this doesn't matter and the last one come on yeah very good I will take this door also and okay now we grabbed a lot of resources here and one steel sheet, that's new metal again. There's these things here. So, let's see. I wanted to build another input hammer and now I can build this. And we got it again. Now let's see where we are. Yeah, we need to just grab this one, then go back. Go back for the other one and uh, yeah, okay. And then for the third one guys, and then if I have enough time, I will just loot more, you know what I mean. And then we will continue on the next map, so... First maps are actually easy, it's mostly day. I mean, it's good weather also, if it's rain it's gonna stop quickly, so... So yeah, now, because I'm gonna go back immediately, and now I see that car there, maybe it's a honeypot case. 
if you find a honey pot, it's again just the car you can dismantle and everything. But this car will have a lot of players in the trunk if you first open it with the pry bar, of course. And not. Uh, Let's see, now this is Minutemen's. They just pop up from the ground like this, dealing electric damage again. And this, this maybe, but this is just a car, so nothing much here. I'm not gonna waste time, guys. Although I could scrap it for more resources. But let's go grab an anchors first. You wanna first clear all the anchors, guys, from the map. And then with any time left you have, you do, you loot everything else what you can and you stay here all up till the zone starts to push you out, you know what I mean and in the first, in the first zone here it's a long time to for the first zone to start to close in I think maybe 25 to half an hour <coughs> 25 minutes to half an hour I meant and uh, you can stay here a long time because the game is designed like this because you have a slow car, these shitty tires to go off-road, and you just need more time to drive around this whole map. That's why it's... That's why it needs much longer time for the zone to start to close in, you know what I mean. So now we are going to pick up the second anchor. Here is some abductors, another car. I don't want any of that. Let's get the fuck out of these guys. Because they are angry here, it's gonna follow much more and be more aggressive, so... Can I see this anchor now without pointing the map? So I don't actually see where it is. But now I know that it's actually on the other side, I'm stupid. So let's go by foot, guys. You wanna do this. You wanna save the car. This is the anchor, but I can't miss this three plasma here, guys. You can always spot this because it's... Okay, I received a bit of damage. But it doesn't matter. Come on. And the third one. Okay, I don't want any more damage. Just give me absolutely everything, man. That's it. So now, just go back to the car. Always watch the top left arrow. And you will always know the direction where you need to go, guys. To go back to the car. Now these guys don't want them to catch me because they will steal this anchor then from my hands and it's not gonna be good, but now it's good. We managed to do it, but he will pull the... Oh! I was so lucky now that he didn't pull the car, guys. And now from here I will just drop down there. And then go pick up all this here. And just see then if it's more time. So now just avoid this guy, please. So that I can safely go down the hill now because I'm not gonna waste time and go all around guys actually I will go and loot this house what I see on the map now and then drop down from there so that house is going to be on the right side now you see how much of plasma here I can't miss any of this you want to grab as much plasma as you can at the start guys so it's always just one spark you know what I mean and once you dodge it, you can then do what you want. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Again, I received a bit of damage, but... Who cares? Okay, I don't want this, but if it's a trunk, that is closed, guys. Now this one is not, but... Uh, let me just see. If it's closed, then you want to open it with the driver and just loot everything. Now it's empty, as you can see. So, yeah, let's just add this here. Continue. What we were doing. So now I see the house from here. There's this house there. And 
And uh, yeah, I will leave the card here again. And just go and see what we have here. So big house, but that doesn't mean there is lots of things here. Now let's quickly see inside. A little bit of health. Okay, I want the radio. All these good parts here. And that's it from this house. Okay, let's go. Just always run towards the arrow, guys. Now again, these guys, but... I don't care too much. Health is on 50%. That's all good too. So now... Need to mark this guy and just go there, guys. So... If you wait like this, they will eventually go in the ground again, but... Come on guys, don't make me turn all the way. But okay, so... Now let's just go down the mountain. I have enough fuel. Batteries, okay. So... Now let's just go down here, guys. Because you can always go down, of course. Just look at the map if it's downhill. You can easily go down, just use the handbrake and... and... Now we see everything from here. Again, a little bit of handbrake. Oh! Okay, I hit the car a bit, but... It's all good, it's all because of the tires, guys. Now more plasma there. Very fucking nice, and the first truck, that's what I wanted to show you. You want to load these trucks like that there, guys. Don't throw the tool, man. And uh, you want to load the compound boxes. But we didn't find any yet. Now this guy, come on, follow me, bitch. Okay, he will grab the car. Now all this radiation, fucking hell, man. I wanted to load all this, you know what I mean. Now he fucked me up, I need to go through here. Just quickly grab the truck then, because radiation will eat me now, but I need to grab all this. Here you can get collectibles, paints, guys. And now I grabbed everything. The prop, I think that's the... That's the... Shifter. Let's loot this. Okay, I need to heal a bit, so... Where you pulled the car, man? All the way up here. I see what abductors are doing. They are just annoying with that pulling the car, you know what I mean? Container, I'm actually full. I need to come back here, so let's just do that. Use more health. And now let's leave everything here. Yeah, that's the shifter, I think, or is the. I don't know what it is. Look how many of these. I don't need all of that. Now let's go back quickly and then I will go for the plasma. All glass shards left. And here a little bit of fabric. That's very nice actually. I will run to there. Because this is very close. So now again, just watch where it's going to go, come on. And just dodge it, you know what I mean, then you can do whatever you want here. If it's only one that's the easiest one, like this. Now let's go back to the car. And let's see, I think I grabbed now... ...all anchors. So what's the damage to the car? Yeah, almost nothing very good. And we grabbed all three anchors, so now I can do what I want, guys. Here the zone started to closing in right now. When you hear this sound. So then let's just go and loot a few more houses. And then get the fuck out of here. Because now if I want, I can jump from here. Just go back to garage. But I don't want that because we need to finish the mission. We need to just go to the second junction, to the next one. And then map that one. So I grabbed this. Now oh, this guy, look at him. 
I grab this, but uh, no, man, fucking hell. But if I now, you see when I pull the shifter and I hold the handbrake, but still it's gonna pull me, yeah, okay, straight there, right? Thank you, bitch. So I'm gonna go for this now also. Because I would go it. Come on, man, don't. All the plasma and all the glass shards, but actually what I want is copper wire here. Also. And now why we are already here, I can do this one also, you know what I mean? Because one... Uh, one off-road tire is 12 rubber, guys, so it's not it's not that cheap, you know what I mean? Don't come here anymore, you bastard. Go your way, yeah. So now what else we can loot? Oh yeah, I'm going there. So that house, and then one more, and then we are exiting this map, guys. So I didn't found any peacemakers yet. I'm hoping I'm gonna rush into one somewhere. That's the car. It looks like... Huh, I don't know how to tell you, but when I found one, I think maybe it's something here. But it's not. I was stupid. Don't need these lights. Now let's just go. And there is a fuel truck, guys. So now I will just actually refuel a bit the car. So the hose is always on this side. You need to stop like this. Just position your car too, so that you can do this, right? And the car is refilled again, I can take all this. Are there more tires? Right. Because rubber is very... You need this rubber a lot. Now you see how much is here, so these trucks are very good off-road tires. You want, to, you want to loot these ones, guys, always. And yeah, too much more. Too more. So this is very, very good now. Come on. I like this a lot. Tool will be gone soon, but the scraper is the easiest one to build. And yeah, now I grabbed everything. What the fuck? Another scraper? Uh, okay, then let's ditch this one and just... <laughs> Take this one, I don't know how this happened now, but I don't care actually. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know where how this scraper magically appeared here, but the come on I didn't <laughs> turn on the car at all. And there is that house, oh my god man. Again, some small shitty house, but let's go. Now you wanna kill all time here, until the dawn pushes you out. And just loot everything you... And now, this is the peacemaker, guys, that's what I was talking about. Now you see how this look like, right? And you can put things inside. Now I don't have plasma here, but I will show you. The only thing that I found that is working, is if you put plasma, that is resource found here in zone 1, it will spit the tree candy for you, and there's the resource in the zone 2. So if you want to get tree candy before you get to zone 2, guys, you need to find these guys. And then just add plasma to them, what I'm gonna do now. And it will give you tree candy in return, and it's going to be 1-1 one, one ratio, so you know what I mean. So now I have 17 plasma. And I'm gonna grab 17. 17 tree candy, and I want to use then the handwork to grab all that. Now you see this. I grabbed 17 tree candy, guys. Somewhere one is somewhere else here, but yeah, okay, here it is. So 17 tree candy for 17 plasma, and that's the only way how you can get this before you get to the zone 2, guys. Yeah, let's just go now. And I'm gonna visit just this house. And I think that I will go then towards the exit. Only if the Arda drop falls somewhere near close to me, you know what I mean? 
Then I'm gonna go for that. This is not opened at all. And there is the another peacemaker, guys. Now you see. Yeah, my battery is fully charged, but you can charge your battery if you drive your car close to that one. Now you see my battery 47.1, right? And if you drive close to this guy, you'll just charge your battery. Now it's fully charged, 50 out of 50. So we can continue. I just want to avoid these fucking abductors, man. Come on, buddy. Let's go, go, go. Yeah, we dodged one. Oh, we didn't dodge, actually. So now let's see. Are you going to pull me, man? He's not going to pull me. Okay. Let's then visit this house. So the, the exit of the map is here. I will just go by foot. And then do the house and this truck. So did I scan this? Yeah, the left, right? Okay. Now let's see. I thought this is the truck, but it's just a fucking gun. Now finally, guys, this is the pneumatic boxes. So deposit pneumatic box, right? You want to loot them again for collectibles, lore pages like this, and pearls, of course. Now I didn't get any pearls, but if you want to get pearls, then you add them to the matter deconstructor. When you are back in the garage and you get a lot of resources in return, guys. So I got actually the hood ornament. I got the first decal, sketchy, and I got two paints. So it's red paint and matcha paint. Very good. And what I wanted here, I wanted to visit this house. And then go from this map. So let's see. Nothing. And here, there's this. So, okay, that's this house done again. Nothing much is here. Yeah, now let's go. Where is the car? There. Again, always watch the arrow, guys. Just run towards the arrow. Now, what you want, man? Go, go. No, don't. Yeah, don't pull the car, bitch. Now, see how much resources I grabbed in this junction, guys. And now we can actually go from here, and there is the other drop. But I don't think I can actually, let's see. If I now, I will just try to go there, but if I see that I'm not gonna make it. But I'm not gonna make it actually, so I'm not gonna go. Because the radiation will eat my car, and I don't need that now. But once you have the iron shield, guys, then you can grab the other drops easily. So yeah, I'm not gonna go there, we will exit the map now. There's nothing much close anymore here. I can go to this house yet, but just don't want to waste any more time. But you want to stay always like these guys, all up, all the way up till the end, until this zone pushes you out, and just loot as much as you can. Now I will drive through this just to show you. So if you run into this left right, we can just stop, hold space, and just wait for this to stop. You know what I mean? Once you stop doing this. You can just continue then. Yeah, it's gonna turn on the wheels and shit. Okay, how long it's gonna... Now it's done. That's it from this junction, guys. So we spent a lot of time now here. Let me just see. It's 3.36. So now when I go to the next junction, there's three hours more. It's always three hours more from junction to junction, guys. But okay, then I can do just this here loot a little bit more of everything. Because why not? We are now at the end of this map. I'm just just wanna grab as much as I can, you know what I mean? I just grab this guy and just grab everything like these guys. You know what I mean? Come on. And now I think this is the storm, that's why these bullets yeah. Yeah, okay, man. Thanks, thanks. Yeah, I don't want them to fucking damage the car now, so we just need to go, actually. Yeah, fucking hell. Look at these things now. They are spawning here now because of the storm, of course. But I want to scan these other guys. Come on, where are you now? 
Shakers, you know what I mean. No shakers. Come on now, why is no shakers, man? And now they are magically spawning once I'm in the car, you know what I mean? And again I failed to to scan them because but okay. It's the same thing as Wallards guys. They will just propel you in the air and then you can receive damage once you fall to the ground of course. And there's these guys here. But again they vanish so quickly I can't scan them. Fucking hell I forgot to put in the park. So yeah, let's just get out from this map guys now. I didn't damage the car a lot, so it's all good. We didn't use repair putties or everything. Okay, I dodged this one and now that's it from this map. Yeah, everything is good. Back off with that shit. And we are leaving now this second junction, we are continuing towards the quest to reach the Sierra guys so yeah I'm gonna do that now and then we'll see what awaits us there but again then once you finish this junction you want to stop here before the end of course then check everything refuel do whatever you need so you don't waste time on the next one you know what I mean because game will automatically save now here then you cannot reload this one again. You want to make sure you grab everything what you want from this junction and then continue to the next one, guys. So now let's just see. And you want to fix only the parts that are starting to go in red, you know what I mean? You don't want to waste putties on things like this now. So this is all good actually. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna use anything. So maybe a little bit of health. So just use all four, because we have a lot more here. And now we can go to the next junction, guys. See what the quest is. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. So let's go. And now from here, we pass the E5. Now you see on the right side what I managed to scan. Abductor left, right, stable anchor, spec tower. Spark towers and sizzling mist, so I didn't find the last two. And uh, more to the right is all this, what you can find actually generator of red car, abandoned car, peacemakers. And I still didn't find two more. And now we need to continue here. So if you press C, we see the perpetual stability is just nothing. It's not going to chase us unless summoned. So storms are good. Then if we press V, we can see everything else. So now again, abductors left, right are here, basically the same map as this one, because it's the dump forest again, guys. But you see this tree, there's the sign for the dump forest map, you know what I mean? And there is no resources here, because all this now is going to be dump forest, you know what I mean? All these first maps is dump forest. So I'm just gonna go now on this next one, and let's continue. And here we are on the JCT E1, guys. So this map is now fairly big, lots of roads, lots of everything. And now you see five anchors here, so I'm not gonna reload now this map, because it's good. I'm fine with these five anchors, maybe I will not actually grab them all. But let's see, because this is actually a tough map, you know what I mean? Lots of these breaks and everything, you need to know exactly where you're going if you want to finish this without damaging the car significantly. So now let's just do that, so go with the story right so all is good and Come battery and everything here. is okay never wanted to think about this place ever again Edgeor town colossal and I see time 7:25 p.m. so 3 hours past and I see this guy there guys when you see this you just drive your car close to it and it's gonna fix your car look at this now now you see why you don't need putties, you don't need anything actually. Now I'm wondering if it's gonna fix the other side also, or is it finished? Don't hit it, man. So is it going to fix this one? So no, it's not, it's, so it's have the, 
duration, like, you know what I mean? And it's called Beating Heart, guys. So now you see how it looks. This was Seismic Squall. So just drive your car next to it, and it's gonna fix it to a certain degree, right? Now let's continue. And you can you cannot miss this because it's glowing in the dark like this. And uh, it's hard to miss, you know what I mean? So now let's go with the story. Because I will show you now this, how you need to go actually to pass this mission. Uh, as quick as possible because uh, if you don't know where you're going guys, this can be really hard actually. So now let's see. Yeah, that's insane man. We need to go down here. Lots of tourists here. And now you see, it says bring your car. Okay, drive into town is first. But there is a truck, guys. This is what we want again. So are the investigator here? Again, you want to loot everything. So what is this? Insulated door. And I'm gonna pick them up and immediately change for for this door of course so throw this away dismantle these guys and put the insulated door and now we have a little bit of electric protection do you know what i mean leave all this here so now i have lots of resources i actually don't want this to throw away all what is taking up space yeah that's about it so this door I actually don't want them, I could scrap them now for resources, but I don't want anymore because there will be lots of harder trailers now in this town where we are going guys and I'm already full so let's see lots of tourists again, we don't want to touch them because they deal lots of damage now where we are, so now here, yeah okay, I know how this needs to be done so first you're just following it, this inside the town, but then I will show you the way how to go exactly where we need to go, right? And another beating heart is here, so I can fix my car even more, but I don't want now. And we are entering the small city here. I don't want to jump through here, of course. I don't want to do that, guys. And now here is the gas station. Yeah, okay, let's park here. They fill the car and then continue with the story. So now again there is no this uh, here there is no container but let's loot everything else then. So lots of these guys around here see these tourists but I don't care too much about them. And inside these stations there are usually not so much things, but now let's see if I... Can I build? Yeah, there is no lights yet, so fuck it. I can't build lights yet, guys. I said I'm not gonna do this, but... Uh, just want these batteries and everything. I'm not gonna have enough space, guys, for all this. But let's see now. So now from here, now from here guys, we need to zoom in, right, and we need to go here, but, look at this now, I'm gonna go grab this anchor, so first grab this guy, because you want to go back in the garage with as much energy collected, of course. So that you can use it later. And this is not the way, actually, but... Let's drive to the anomaly then. So I'm just gonna go now, here. As close to this as possible. Yeah, a little bit of radiation here, but 
It's all good. Come on, man. No response. So now it's no response, of course. Can you find a way to high ground? We need to find a way around it. So now I just want to get out from this fucking radiation. And I don't know where the fuck am I actually going, guys. So I need to look at the map. But okay, I'm out of it now. So let's just go here. Yeah, this is actually where I need to go, but let's now start looting a bit because now we can end this mission really quickly. So I want to grab as much as I can. Little bit of bulbs, and I'm not gonna do anything else, but I'm gonna loot all what is in these houses now. And now just here and to the right. But again, this is not the whole way, I will show you now, guys. This is actually the way. So lots of these guys, I wanna avoid them, of course. Now these trailers, I'm gonna start just to gather everything. And now without the limb shield, I need to remove these guys immediately from the car because they deal damage over time. And that's the first bunnies, guys. Broken bunnies, they deal damage over time if you leave them on the car, of course. Now let's start looting all of this. Don't have any light yet, but let's use some flares then. So I'm not gonna grab any of this, I just wanna loot as quick as possible. And go from here, so not this. Just what's in the containers. Now you see this, if I throw like this again, it's just gonna explode. Now these guys, yeah, okay, that's them. I don't have the pry bar, oh my god, man, how can I do this? Just one pry bar, thanks. So let's see what we have here. I just need to grab everything from these lockers, guys. There's the chemicals here. And this is all good again. Now let's bring the car more. Let's go inside. And now here is where we're going to jump into the anomaly, but... First, let's grab everything and we need to activate the door. So you want to loot all of this, what is around here. And then... And then jump through that portal, you know what I mean? So let's just do that now, guys. Come on, give me more of everything. Yeah, very good. I'm not gonna do any of this. Just uh, things that I can pick immediately. And now let's go to the tower. More anomalies there. Come on, where is the door, man? What the fuck? Grab all this, give me that back. So where is the entrance? Here. Oh. Fuck off. Very good. But how can I go then? Here. Oh. I'm idiot sometimes, guys. Let's use the last flare. And now I just pull this button here. The door is opened. Ah, uh, ceiling hit. That's actually good. So 
So give me that in my hands, man. Throw that shit down there. Yeah, one ceiling hit for free, okay. Let's fix something with that. So is something need for stealing kit? It's not. I don't have space to leave it, but it's okay because we are finishing now this mission, guys. So after you loot everything, just start the car and jump to this anomaly, right? And we are going back to the garage now. But I'm actually not finished yet with the looting. Because why not grab all this? No, I mean. But uh, yeah, I wanted this. Bulb and blast shots, that's it. So now lots of uh, resources here, everything. We grabbed a lot of everything, guys. The car is not significantly damaged at all. So I will easily fix it when I go back to garage. And let's just do that then. I'm not gonna stop anymore for this. Now a little bit of these guys and we are back in the garage. And here we are back in the garage guys. The car flew like a rocket, sometimes games does this. And now we have a quirk as you can see when I swerve my wheel left and right. The lights dims or something like that. But because we can't use the Tinker Station yet, guys, I can't do any, anything about that yet. So now let's see, let's scan this guy. So it's a status monitor, right? Okay, let's click through all of this while she is talking. So now when you come back from the run guys, what you want to do of course, you want to scrap this guy and use the dumpster three times, right? So I'm just gonna do that now, and then we're gonna do everything else. Because uh, we grabbed so much resources now, when I visit the fabrication station, we can build a lot of things. And I'm gonna show you now, what's the best things to build at the start, you know what I mean? So now let's just use the handbag. Try to grab all this. Yes, yeah, sometimes this tool. It's not working. I mean, it's working, but not so good. That's why I want to build always the second tier tool. Now I'll use this guy three times. So we have lots of tasks to do at the right. But I will not repair, guys, the car because I will now build all steel. So now let's just see. So I will grab this guy now, right? So that I can add things here. But first, uh, let's just do this. And okay, like this. So now you grab this and go around and just pick up everything you want. Sort everything out, you know what I mean? Because now things will go in the trunk, in the transfer trunk, right? Okay, so now when you use this three times, it's not gonna give anymore, you know what I mean? Three times each run. Now you see it's exhausted, so you grabbed everything. Now the next thing, this is the shelf, right? So here we can leave paints and decals. So let's just do that first, and of course the prop. So now you see when you press V, guys, you can see where this thing is going. So it's a hood ornament, and it's empty. But because I didn't build this station yet, we can't use the decals and the paints, but we can leave them here, right? Then the next thing, let's visit this locker. I want to get rid of this and leave here them for later, because a lot of pages are going here in the computer when we build it, when we build it and for now just... So yeah, okay, I need to start actually doing things, building everything. Now if you come here and press E guys, it will tell you what you need to do. So road flares, okay. I think we have all that, just give me these flares. And now, so just repair the car, we won't do that, but now let's finally visit the fabrication station guys and start unlocking everything, right? So what is this now, pen shelf, okay. 
And finally, fabrication station, guys. We have 5.5 stable energy, right? So first thing what you want to build is matter deconstructor. But I'm missing one gear. So let's just build one gear now. And first, let's build matter deconstructor, guys. Because this will give you the option to add now things inside and get resources in return, right? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna grab this and first get rid of all this, right? Now you see more resources I'm getting. Now we will start demolishing the car and just... Okay, yeah, let's take this. Also, now with the button Y, you can sort this here. And let's throw the tire also. Because you want to throw everything that you don't want in this guy and get resources in return, guys. So now this light, actually just throw it away here for now. We will change the light probably and let's start removing everything guys. So now just do it like this and start adding them here, right? So what is not steel is going here now and we will throw it away. Get the resources in return guys and then and then just build old steel, you know what I mean? So now again... Just throw everything here and just grab all. This is how you do it when you want to change your build. And especially at the start, because... Uh, you don't want to have crude at all, you know what I mean, guys? So... Just do this and then... Oops. Why? Just take off the door, man. So what else we have? This. And let's throw everything again here. Now we're gonna build everything still. And we're going to build the off-road tires, guys. You know what I mean? Now, did I take everything and this light screwed headlights? Okay, this is steel and I want this door, okay. Yeah, so now let's see guys. Throw these also. And now when we grab everything, just leave that here. And now let's go and unlock more things guys. So now next, what to build next, right? So the best things to build here at the start is this improved antenna later, then the junction restabilizer, then investigator module, and this matter regenerator, guys, these four, you know what I mean. And then outfitting station and all this later. But now we want to unlock this so we can build lights and we need to unlock bulbs first so that you can unlock the steel sheets, right? And with the steel sheets now we can build the car all with steel. That's why I did this. Now with 4.3 guys, I can immediately unlock the turbo light engine, you know what I mean? And then drive fast, but I'm not gonna do that, this is going to be the next goal. What I want to build now is first all steel, right? All steel parts. So the bumper. Then... Then the plates. And then the doors, of course. Now when we have all steel, the next thing we want to do is off-road tires, guys. So you first need to unlock the summer tire, 0 0.5. And now I can unlock the off-road tires, right? Then it's 1.5, so it's a bit expensive. Now I'm left with just 0 0.8. And let's see, can I build maybe the normal lights? And yes, that's the normal lights, guys. 0.5. Now we don't have any more, but let's just see the goals for the next. So the next goal is the turbo light engine. We need four stable energies, right? And then maybe start building something from here. Build the liberator then, so we can grab, start grabbing armored parts. And then we will see. I'm not going to spend too much time now here. Because we now need to build all of this, right? But first, where is my 
Where is my trunk? Come on, man. Give me that. First, let's get rid of the tires, guys. So again, just throw this here. And start adding tires. Into this guy. Just do the same here. Now let's just do this. First, so throw them all away again, guys. All four tires, goodbye. We need rubber. To build now these new ones, right? And now let's start building. Let's just see. Yeah, okay, give me that, actually. Leave all that here. And let's start building, guys. So now you see, it's yellow because it's new, newly unlocked. And we need gears, but it's gonna build it. So let's just do it. One tire, two, three, and four tires, guys. I just grab them like this and start doing it. Now you see the car is gonna automatically be fixed. You know what I mean? Because it's all new parts. You don't need to waste putties, anything. Okay, now let's see. One panel, two panels, three, four panels. Four steel panels, right? They are there. Again, just steel sheets. One. Then it's gonna build the sheets. Two. Three. No. And this is four now. But because they didn't grab the transfer trunk, I have just then do it like this, guys. Now you see, I built the whole car steel and the off-road tires also after just the first two runs, but you need to loot everything. So now we need front and the right front and right bumpers, right? Again, steel sheets. I don't know if I'm gonna build everything actually. Okay, that's two bumpers, one here, one on the front. Now I have one light, but yeah, we need three three doors actually. Hmm. Let's see, can I build just three more doors? Come on. It's good because it's only one steel sheet, guys. Yeah, and three doors. Very good, very good. I like this now, guys. So, and whole car is steel. Now I just need. Where is the repair put this here? Grab all this. Also, just leave it there. Now let's just fix fully what is left to fix. So this, the engine, and then I will actually change the lights, guys. Also. So again, whatever you don't want, just throw it here. And now I have one light, so I just need to build one more. And let's add the lights here. And now you see the whole car is still. We have new headlights. This what I found and off-road tires, guys. Now only the engine is next, and then these upgrades will gonna go next around the car. Let's grab again everything, just leave it there. And now, the car is ready to go. Let's just see. Okay, the light and the door actually. The light and the door. So now I think the whole car is fixed, everything is good. Let's just take everything now, just to see. And this is almost full now with the button Y, I can sort again. And... Oops, let's just check this again, one more time. So this is all just here, okay. And I think we are ready guys for the next run. Of course we can't do quirks yet, so we need to chart the zone. And now because I know the whole map, and everything I will start doing one of these so probably this one yeah let's select this one and I see again on the right side what I found so far here 
in the damp forest, right? Even if I didn't go here, but it's gonna count for all these maps that are the same, you know what I mean? So whatever I found here, it's gonna be the same, almost the same on each one of these, so that's how it is. I mean, it's not gonna be all the same, but similar, you know? And here we have the spark surge, if I press C, we don't know what it is yet, but I will find out now when I go there. And yeah, so we now just need to go on the next run, gather as much resources as we can again. So now I will just leave here anything that I don't actually need. And that's going to be it guys, so now I just need to left the, this shit, and everything else will go with me. Then later when I go back now the goal is to gather resources for for the turbo light engine and then these racks and starting to build things around the car of course. So that's that's gonna be the next goal now. So for the turbo light engine we need four stable energy. So maybe I'm not gonna grab all this now but we will see. Let's we'll do one quick run and that's going to be it and then I'm gonna map maybe this one or who knows. So if you like what you see guys, please consider liking, subscribing and commenting and join me in the next episode. So I need to just build two of these. So two mechanics kit just in case and two ceiling kits that's just for the tires. And that's all I need actually. And all four tools so far. So we have everything now. This guy will die soon but it doesn't matter. And yeah, we want to build then this thing of course for the character upgrades and we will build everything guys as we go so now all is good i can just go and do another run guys so again thank you for watching if you like what you see so you like it subscribing and commenting join me in another episode so now i will just make two saves here and we will continue from here so thank you again and see you in another video guys bye